Let's go. Hey, you guys, this is Jeff back with another fish, and uh, we just got another little bluegill. I keep on having this one big bass come after it, a well, big catch on a four weight at least, and uh, I'm actually quite surprised because they normally don't uh, bite the hare's ear nymph, but um, uh, that's what we're using, and uh, so uh, we'll get back to you when I unhook him. Right, McGill forceps. Go. Hey, you guys, this is Jeff back with another fish. He's just a little fingerling bass, but uh, hey, a fish is a fish. And uh, caught him on my right McGill fly rod, four weight. Um, uh, check it out. I'll put a link in the description. Till then, adios. Go. Hey, you guys, this is Jeff back with another video. Sorry, I haven't posted in a long time. Um, uh, we just, the weather hasn't been what it should be and uh, we haven't gotten to go fishing in a while but I uh, as you can see I just caught a nice bass on a hare's ear nymph with my uh, new fly rod so uh, the fly rod that I'm using is the Wright and McGill plunge it's on amazon.com I'll go ahead and put a link in the description um, uh, so uh, till that next fish adios go hey you guys this is Jeff back with another fish this one's a nice little bluegill got him again on the Wright and McGill plunge um, uh, He's a nice little bluegill, and uh, it's about the size of what we've been catching. I had a nice bass go after it just then as well, um, uh, but he beat him to the punch. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and get him unhooked with my new Wright McGill forceps, and uh, we'll be back. Uh, Till then, adios.